We've spoken about the supply side of the industry. Um, I suppose product ultimately is key to what we do. Uh, we're all passionate about it. When you're looking at tech as a, as a product area, what do you see as being the current trends and do you see some development in, in, in that area and what, what might, they, might, they, might they be? Well, the promotional technology is split into uh, three core areas. You've got um, audio products, which is things like Bluetooth speakers, headphones, earbuds, products which are designed to enhance your listening or your, uh, your viewing of your uh, iPad, of your uh, tablet or your phone. You've then got what we call portable power, which is devices such as power banks, cables, wireless charging, which are there to keep your device charged up during the working day. And then we have kind of unusual, quirky lifestyle gifts. Um, for example, things like these, which are a pair of Bluetooth sunglasses, yeah. which you actually can listen to your music through your sunglasses. Cool. So we have some kind of really wacky things like that. But at the moment, I suppose the hot trends for us are wireless charging. So the ability to charge your phone without any cables is something which is really taking uh, the market by storm at the moment, particularly given Apple's introduced and shipped a lot of their new iPhone X's at Christmas. That's really pushed the wireless market um, forward big time. We've mm -hmm. been selling wireless charging products, as you know, for about two or three years, um, but always been a bit of a struggle to get that going without the yeah, yeah. force of Apple. So that's really uh, a big one at the moment. And as we mentioned earlier, the whole sustainable and eco side of the business is something we're taking a really close look at at the moment. And hopefully by the time we get to your show in April, then we should be able to have some news for you on that as well. Exciting times. Yeah. Um, with regards to wireless charging, um, obviously there's, a, there's, a, there's an important health and safety uh, requirement in that area. Could you just talk us through the QI compliance and the, the speed of charging? Yeah, those sorts sure. Of things? I know it's important um, to the audience. Yeah, sure. Wireless charging is governed by uh, a, an organisation called the Wireless Consortium, uh, and they have designed a little kind of quality, almost like a kite mark, like you yeah. all know, um, or like the, the uh, what they call the made for iPhone kind of brand. So there's this little uh, symbol on a lot of our products called the Qi symbol, which is a Q and an I, and that basically means that the product is tested to the highest levels of standard and only products that get to that level of safety and compliance can hold the, the so-called Qi mark of quality. Okay. So we're really pushing and promoting with you a lot of our products from one of our major partners called Zens, um, who are all their products are certified with the Qi symbol, mm -hmm. which means your customer has no concern whatsoever about the, uh, the, the, the movement of the power from the, from the charger to the, to the product, to the phone. Okay, excellent. I suppose a link to quality, um, in part is security and we're hearing more and more now from our customer base and also within the, within the <coughs> media regarding um, contactless card fraud for example and then the development of RFID to combat that. Yeah. Views on that, importance of the sector, where your product range will be heading to. Yeah, I to mean, help we've we introduced we've been we were actually asked by yourselves to introduce that in in September. So we've introduced a range of <laughs> leather um, RFID protection wallets, which are, are, are really nice. Um, at the moment, we see it very much as a kind of almost like a slightly London centric type um, yeah, product. Card, so it's tube, very much yeah. tube, bus. So it's the places where you're in close proximity to other. Um, uh, other users that you potentially get can get the fraud of people stealing your, your contact. But mm -hmm. yeah, certainly we've seen a big in increase in demand from particularly financial services industry um, who you know, are looking for that link between security and money. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, we're, we're sort of looking to ad advance our range of RFID protection products for the future. Matt, thanks ever so much for your time. Really enjoyed the chat. Um, I think our customers are going to really enjoy watching this video uh, and they'll get peace of mind from the standards that you guys have in place. Really appreciate it. Thank you. Cheers, Paul. That's good.